Welcome. This um, video is all about an update that came along. We are now at kernel 4.20, which is super, last day of 2018. And we get also VirtualBox 6.0. They were together. The one was waiting for the other. So it's a, a duo here. And uh, the one cannot live without the other. But what happens when we boot up Super F7 is my shortcut for VirtualBox. This is the look we have now, and I've just recorded everything. I've updated, um, so made some pictures for the article. This is how it looked before. This is our look before, and it's so much nicer um, before the update, right? And after the update, we get this this thing you will the thing you see here. And there was also a picture of the updates where you can, could see actually the elements that we just updated, which is this one. So we see that we have Linux 4.20 and VirtualBox 6. All right, fine. But now we need to explain you some things because this is really not workable. This is not nice at all. Okay. What we're going to do is make VirtualBox look nice again. Control T. We are going to sudo pacman minus s and then you have to remember the word quantum. Just keep pressing twice on tab and then you find here quantum qt5 is the one you want and quantum theme arc is maybe also a possibility. It's up to you to decide later if you want it or not. Anyway, you need these applications. What's done with when that is done, you can uh, go look for a application called Quantum Manager. But first we are going to go to another application, Super Shift D in, in our case here. There's also right mouse click. It's going to be here in some somewhere in here as well. And I want the QT5 CT, uh, which is probably somewhere in here. I'm not going to lose any time. Super Shift D. QT5 CT is the one I want. It's going to take a while to load up. It seems to be having some problems with the hello icons. But just wait for it. It will come. And the other application I want is Super Shift D. And that's a new one. Quantum Manager. So that's what QT5 CT brings along with this Quantum Preview. So let's boot that up as well. And here he is. So Qt5ct, this is the first one to the left and that's the new one, Quantum Manager we have uh, here. Now these two guys need to be together because I need to tell in Qt5 configuration tool that he should use Quantum or Quantum Dark. You choose uh, and see what you like. Apply. So this is set here. If we Super F7 here, Super F7, then we get already some kind of uh, change because of it. Now you can select the quantum team folder, you can change the lead themes and you can configure an active team. So there are options in here to um, select, but let's make this can go and let's make this bigger so we can read more. We can change and delete. So here we have to change the quantum default, Super F7 check that's that one and then we go and have a look you can have arc and then you use this theme so super f7 it's gonna be where is super f7 back there there's this kind of look you need to basically kill it every time to make sure that you what you apply to the this virtual box here is is really the thing you want but a lot of things in here, so we can go to Art Dark, which is nice as well. And then Super F7. Yeah, there he is. And you can keep on experimenting. I think the one I'm probably going to use is, is Art Dark. Use this theme. Super F7. And this is a really kind of black one, maybe too black. So it it's depends, you just choose, I just give you the tools to choose. And it's up to you to decide whether you want it in all, in all white here, or rather 
more in black. So there you go, that's our solution for now to get this fix out of the way and we can quit here and next time we do Super F7, we've chosen for a look and this is going to be the black look now. Alright, have fun!